Hello YouTubers, today I want to show you uh, something else than glitching. Uh, I got one LCD display from my friend a few weeks ago and this one is broken down and I'm trying to fix it and I think I uh, I can get I can get it fixed. So this video is for you if you wanna know how to fix the Philips LCDs and you have the same problem. So, uh, what's the problem with this? Uh, oh, first, I have disassembled this the wall, the wall display already. There's the plastic case and other things on the table. And so, what's the problem with this? If I power it up, you can see the screen goes on for one second or so and then black again. So, if I use my flashlight, uh, you can see there is. Wait. Here you got no connection window going, so the screen is working, but the backlight is in. There's something wrong with that. As you can see, every time I now power this up, do this on for black, on for one second, and then off. So let me take that power cord. Uh, power off from the display and show you what's wrong with this. Okay, this is the back side of the LCD display, and as you can see, here is the control panel, panel, and the power where the all power is coming to the LCD, and here is the inverter for the four back backlights, cold cathodes. And firstly, I noticed these capacitors was really uh, was in really bad shape, so I replaced them. But that wasn't the problem. Um, after that, I uh, tested the backlights. They are fine. If I switch this backside, uh, this uh, backlight to here, and other side around. Mm, this light start up and this doesn't so the problem must be on this side and these two sides are identical and the problem with this is if you measure this coil here is the coil thing if you measure this uh, other side uh, here it shows 500 ohms or near that and here it shows nothing, so the problem is this coil have a broken wire inside this case. And we are going to replace that, this is the broken one, and I have a new one right here. I ordered that from eBay, cost about 5 years. And let's see, we will change stand and see if this works. Ten. And now for the moment of truth. Power is coming through and I replaced the bars. Let's power it on and see what happens. And the screen, go, screen goes on and it fucking works. Great stuff. Yes, let's put that hold the display back together and see how it looks like. And the display is working just fine. Now it's hooked up to my computer. Uh, if you try this home, be sure you know what you are doing. And if you don't know anything about electronics or something like that, don't be sure don't try this at home. I don't take any responsibility for anything what you are doing. So you are on, on your own when you are doing this. I hope you enjoyed and thanks for watching.